okay. So I'm gonna actually pre-cook uh, the chicken we just bought. So we're gonna make a marinade and uh, later today I'm gonna uh, grill them. So let's prepare the chicken. So the chicken, organic chicken we just bought. This is actually from Japan. I don't know how you call it in English, but this one makes uh, meat really tender. So I use this all the time. Uh, vinegar, then a little bit of uh, this Korean barbecue, the sauce, not too much, a little bit of this. Really simple, but really good. It's gonna be easier to cook. this so this one is good no fat it's like this well, it's, this is actually a little uh, thick so make it thinner So this is gonna be probably three, four days for chicken. And uh, I have some steak, steak once a, once a day. Most of our meals are chicken, I have one fish meal, one egg white, chicken, then a steak. Okay, so the, this powder make meat tender. I just, I don't have that much. So. My couple of my friend is coming from Japan for Olympia, so I need to ask them to get this. This Korean barbecue sauce. This good, not too much. This good. Yes, and uh, this is my third meal. I'm going to the gym right now, so uh, it's gonna be possible to go meal. It, it is. I eat mostly rice, you know, brown rice, uh, from my from my carb carbohydrate source. But this is the only one. Uh, oatmeal I, I eat uh, right after the training. So this gluten free oatmeal underground. You see that? Ground hundred gram. Actually, uh, taste-wise, isofusion tastes pretty good, but it's really thin because it's uh, ice rate, so it's 
goes into system, system, your system right away. But taste-wise, I like MyoFusion better. MyoFusion is a whey protein blend, but it has more flavor in it than especially the new flavors. Maple, bacon, pancake, hazelnut, chocolate, and uh, caramel pretzel. These are so good. I, I love them, but since I made a week's out, so I just stick with the uh, isofusion. So it's a uh, quick oatmeal, so it's actually two minutes. Good. for ice cream on it. One, two scoop, so it's 50 gram protein. Just mix together. Yummy. This is meal three, post workout meal ready. So it's time to go to the gym. Okay, so uh, let's make a pre workout. This is all, all Super Pump 3.0, but it's actually pretty good stuff, so I still use this. And uh, of course, we don't have no more, this is the last. Last bottle. Seems good about this. To the pan. To the ice. To the dry coffee. Seems good about this. By the way, I consume almost three gallons of water a day. So this is my uh, second bottle, almost one. So, I'm in the last one scoop. It has 10 grams of BCAA and a lot of uh, egg rice. One scoop. Okay, dry coffee. How are you? Sorry, brother. Sorry.
customers keep coming in. They're gonna make this come here. So this is the last. This model is gone. So I put uh, two scoop dry coffees here. One scoop on your last. This is my micro uh, workout. Okay, ready. Let's go. SFC technique today, just straight set, but trying to go as heavy as possible around 8 to 12 reps. So sometimes we mix around, sometimes high intensity with SFC, which is really demanding. Another day, like today, is heavy, but not so much, too much intensity, so you can, you know, keep the fullness. If you train, like high intensity all the time, you start losing some. Some point you start losing the density, the size. So we mix up. Okay, so time to cook. Time to cook. Look good. Why 
Like I said, this pin sitting in the fridge uh, 10 hours, 6 hours, 6 hours. So uh, it should be really tender. It's gonna be 3 4 days, days supply, but you know, the fourth, fourth day it still uh, tastes uh, fresh. Sunday uh, cardio going to shopping then uh, going to the gym then food cooking the evening then going to sleep this is typical Sunday I like Sunday you know even though I'm in a, the cafe is still open but uh, Gym is kind of slow, then uh, you know, kind of relax. I, I like cooking, you know, so it's kind of recharging. I like uh, training it on Sunday because, like I said, it's the gym is quiet. Then, uh, you know, getting ready for new week. Since I moved to the, the States, uh, I uh, spent most of the time in Los Angeles. And, uh, you know, LA is nice, not too hot. But Vegas is really hot, but this is uh, kind of getting new mecca of bodybuilding. Lots of bodybuilders left California and I moved here. And, uh, gym is you know, everywhere, like City Athletic. This, uh, uh, it's gonna be new Mecca and uh, I'll show you a good place for bodybuilding. 